Hey guys, I am Vaibhav and welcome to Autonix Pro. Uh, so in today's video, we will be discussing about BS versus BS6 and also we will discuss uh, what is BS6 fuel and what is impact of BS4 fuel on BS6 vehicle and what is impact of new BS6 fuel on your old BS6 vehicle. But I uh, will make a different uh, video on this. Uh, so what you have to do is just subscribe my channel and check my latest updates. Basically, BS4 and BS6, Bharat Stage 4 and Bharat Stage 6 are the emission norms that set the maximum permissible limit for a pollutant that emit from vehicle's exhaust and these norms uh, mainly focus on minimizing the pollutant emissions from vehicle which run on the Indian roads. As we move from BS4 to BS6, these norms get strict. As we see in the petrol cars, uh, the BS6 norms are uh, required to emit a maximum of uh, 60 mg per kilometer of nitrogen oxide and no more than that. And before the cap was of 80 mg per kilometer. Uh, that means in BS6, the nitrogen oxide emission was 80 mg per kilometer and in BS6, it is brought down up to 60 mg per kilometer, uh, which will definitely reduce the harmful gases and also help in decrease in the pollution. The emission norms for diesel engine cars is more strict compared to uh, petrol engine cars. In diesel engine cars, the nitrogen oxide emissions are brought down from 250 mg per kilometer to 80 mg per kilometer and hydrocarbon and nitrogen oxide mixture emission must reduce from 300 mg per kilometer to 170 mg per kilometer and PM that this particulate matter emissions must reduce by 25 mg per kilometer to 4.5 mg per kilometer. Due to BS6, the nitrogen oxide uh, emission will come down by 25% in case of petrol and 68% in case of diesel. The PM for diesel cars will reduce by 80%. This is because India has committed to cut down its carbon footprint by 30 to 35% in 10 years. And that's why the reason we have skipped the BS5 norms. And if this line or if full video was helpful, was a bit helpful for you, then must like uh, this video because it inspires me to make uh, such uh, content full video and informative video and once these uh, norms will come into effect the emission levels of India will match the other standards and other advanced automobile technologies seen across the globe like European and the US countries. If you all want some advanced video, informative videos, automobile content videos then do subscribe my channel and if you want you can share also and see you in my next video.